happening today. Both Charleston mayoral candidates are back to the debate stage for a special runoff debate. This comes as early voting for all Charleston County runoff elections began yesterday. And News 2's Walker Simmons is joining us live right now from the News 2 rooftop. Walker, both candidates are heading into the debate stage tonight with a large base of supporters. Good morning. Hey, Megan Octavia, good morning. And that's right, there's a lot of anticipation around this runoff election, which leads us to tonight's debate. This is vital for each candidate as they're making their case, and this is a great opportunity to make that case to voters before they select either name on the ballot. Now, keep in mind, incumbent John Tecklenburg and challenger William Cogswell both came out of this last election, each with a large pool of voters. Cogswell had 36% of votes, while Tecklenburg was right behind with 32%. But that still leaves a large pool of voters, roughly a third, who didn't choose either candidate in this last election. And now they'll have to choose a side if they vote in the runoff. Both candidates are aware of this heading into tonight's debate. How they perform in this debate can have an impact on where voters stand. Ahead of tonight's debate, News 2 heard from each candidate on their thoughts heading into this tight runoff. And I'm feeling great about the campaign this morning because I've been talking to so many people, our own supporters, but also new supporters from some of the candidates uh, who are no longer in the race. We want to bring uh, new supporters in. We're talking to the other candidates, hoping that uh, them and their supporters will come in our direction uh, because we really want this to be a campaign about all of Charleston. Months of campaigning coming down to its final days now. Election Day is this upcoming Tuesday, the 21st, and tonight's News 2 debate starts at 8 p.m. Live on the News 2 rooftop, Walker Simmons. Count on two.